Welcome to Car Shops and Collections. It's good to see you guys. Thanks for watching the show. Really appreciate you guys watching the show. And if you like what you see, subscribe, give it a thumbs up. Tonight's going to be special. It's the first ever rat ride edition of Car Shops and Collections. We've got not one, but two rat rides here tonight. We've got a 1936 Cadillac and also a 1930 Ford Model A. My friends Teresa and David have them waiting for us. You guys ready? Hey, hey, hey! Look at these two. And look at these two cars as well. Ah, it is great babies. to see you, David. Great to see you, Teresa. You how too. are you? <laughs> great to see you. Good to see you, buddy. Wow. Thank you for coming. Look at these. <laughs> my name is Teresa. This is my 1936 Cadillac Series 75 Touring Sedan. And her name is Miss Theo. Teresa, I don't even know where to start with this. This is just, I didn't have the words for this Cadillac. Um, okay, when did you get this? Well, um, I think we actually acquired the car, what was of her, mm -hmm. uh, late 2017. But we didn't have time to really, you know, get involved, to, uh -huh. to, to start the project. And then finally, um, we started coming up with an idea. Um, she was in a river for a great many number of years. Yeah, you guys, this was this was in, literally in a river in when a you guys river, found this. A naturally formed river um, up in Beatty, Nevada. Mm -hmm. And uh, so she had been parked under a hood or under a, like a shed. Yeah. And so the top of her stayed relatively preserved. So this well, is the original top? Yep. All right. So the whole top half of her was, was pretty well preserved. The bottom half um, it got its butt kicked. <laughs> um, large, there's there's dents and dings. Oh, okay, yeah, but this is, you kept, this and, is obviously this is all original dents and dings. Yes, Why take them out? Those are her life, that's her life story. So a lot of people, you know, they had a hard time. They're like, what, what were you trying to do here, concept? Mm -hmm. And I said, well, it's like a reverse barn find. <laughs> it's the only the only the, way I could kind of come up with something. But the paint, so the paint. Yes. Tell me about the paint. So the paint, um, I knew I, I wanted her to be black. Yeah. I mean, it is a big Cadillac. It what other is. color is there? So I knew she was going to be black. And then we actually sandblasted everything down and re-rusted the actual metal. And then from looking at pictures from when we first got it, while it was sitting in the yard, we tried to follow a lot of the water lines. Okay. Um, it was very difficult because... Would this be then the water lines? Of... Yes. Okay. So this, this thing was in a river, the water was this high on it. Yes. And look the way you guys have it now. David, this is a masterpiece which you guys did to this vehicle. Can I see? Can we see inside it? Yes. Okay. And you guys also make wood burning stoves, correct? We are. We're and masonry contractors, but on the side we do the stoves. So a lot of these, the, the features we see are from wood burning stoves? Yes, all these little caps are all, all the hinge caps. I mean, this interior, yes. tell me more about it. It looks like you have AC and some modern, you know, modern luxuries inside this thing. Yes. <laughs> yeah, power steering, power brakes. Can I step inside? Yes, jump yep. up in there. All right. Just watch your head. Yeah. Okay, power steering, power brakes, you have AC inside of this. The floor, tell me more about the floor. Yeah, all four wheel drive okay. in there. And this, all this floor is hand bent. This is quarter inch hex rod. And you have to twist it one way, the other way, the other way, and so forth. So every single uh, piece here was handmade. Two and a half hours to make one piece. How long did it take you guys to get the, this, the Cadillac to its current state? A little over two years. That's fast. Yeah. Yeah, Lance, so look inside here. Like and, look, and look at the roof inside here too. Every night, um, all weekend, every every extra second we got. Little knob. Yeah. On your side, pull it out. Oh, we got lights back here. Yeah, we got. Well, there's lights. The whole thing lights up all the way around on the hood, up here on the headliner. I mean, it all lights up. This is, you know, Cadillac is the the ultimate. Something is is the best of the best. It is a Cadillac, yes. and to me, this is the Cadillac of rat rods. It is a Cadillac, but I'm saying it's the best <laughs> of the best of rat rods. This is just nuts. <clears throat> the Fleetwood badge up front that was added in. Yeah, yeah. that was where the that original was. radio was. Okay, and then the badge is there. The cold, normal, hot temperature there, and the gas gauges there. Flanging is up right behind the steering wheel. Are those original gauges? Those original. These gauges over here are, are original. Uh huh. The two white ones, white and silver, are new. Because, um, you know, back in 36, everything was six volt. Mm -hmm. So, and there wasn't much left of 
some of the larger gauges and different things in the in the original dash. This is so spacious, though. Look, I mean, I'm, I have so much room here in the back seat. This oh, is yeah. luxury. This is luxury. Hop in, Teresa, to show, to show, to show we're watching the amount of space that we have in this thing. Oh my gosh. Now that steering wheel is made out of supply line to a hot water heater. What, okay, so yes. your mind when you're putting this together, how did you come up with that steering wheel? We were trying and trying hard to yeah. figure out something fantastic for this rotted out steering wheel. Uh -huh. so we redid the banjo oh, with, with the three, because we like everything in three. Okay. My wife. Oh, yeah, it's my favorite number. And then, uh, I did some lines on mine for the heater. Yeah. I didn't want to do the typical water line. So I came up with this design with the uh, copper uh, welded into the. Yeah, a, a, uh, around a hot line. water supply line. And and she goes, My God, I want that. Yeah. And, and so we found the supply line large enough that we could slide her over the original steering wheel. So that, the, the original steering wheel is that right there. Wow. Yeah. 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 And then re welded and so forth. So that's the size of the original steering wheel. That's yes. Everything's original. David, can we see under the hood? Yeah. All right. Oh, yeah. After you. Okay. I feel like we're going to uh, some ball or something in this beautiful, <laughs> this beautiful Cadillac. <laughs> I mean, yes. And the she's... color, too. The purple you went with, I love that. I love Purple that. Purple is my favorite color. <laughs> and um, yeah, so we did have uh, some help um, from some very good friends. And okay, you know, because- original badges on the car? Those are her original badges. Oh. Yep. Okay, and how, I fast have, it, how fast do you get this up to? Oh, she can go pretty fast. Like a 90 coming back from there. Arizona. I couldn't keep 90. up with You had it up to 90. Yeah. This thing should be in the movies. <laughs> it really should. <laughs> I absolutely love this car. It's it's a lot of car to drive. It's a big car. Um, I was scared of it at first. Uh -huh. Just, you know. Yeah. Because it, uh, it's a lot of car. <laughs> and when you're in the driver's seat, <clears throat> you can't see the passenger side. So I have no idea where my passenger side wheel or fender, nothing because you can't see it. <laughs> Did I see a reverse camera up there inside? No, that yeah. is, that, we can't add it, so we haven't added it yet. Yeah. I mean, come on, no reverse camera. We, we're out of here. Spectacular. Um, this I is spectacular. I have thought about, because that the stereo system we put in there is, is pretty magnificent, and it's capable of a lot. Is this but, original? Uh-huh. From 1936, I mean, that's, that's history right there. Yes. All of her badges were on her. Mm-hmm. And uh, this so, is the only thing that we actually didn't touch. I hit this with a sandblaster and, cre you know, went all the way down to metal and came up. Yeah. I wasn't going to take all those out and no. redo them. Yeah. So we so left that, that left all it. original. Of course, everything else has been painted and sandblasted. And so okay. Much, so this is rat rod number one, our <laughs> 1936 Cadillac. You guys ready for rat rod number two, our 1930 Ford Model A? I'm Dave Alexander. This is my little rat, 1930 Model A. David, I don't even know where to start with this. This is, it, it's stunning. Okay, when did you get it? Got it four years ago. Uh -huh. uh, Teresa said she wanted a rat because she's seen a, a rat rod. She's like, my God, I'd, I'd love that. Mm -hmm. And so this was the first one that came to the house on a trailer from California and I took it. Now I should have thought it through, got something a little bit bigger and yeah. more comfortable, but I was excited. I took it and started building it. Okay, let's let's kind of walk through it front to back here. And so let's start here with the grill and stuff. There's this spider webs. You built this all yourself. What, what was going through your mind when you do the spider web? I like spiders and right. I thought the web was kind of cool. And then I did the hands around the lights because I seen the movie Jeepers Creepers. Yes. And that goes around his face uh -huh. when he goes to sleep. So I thought the hands were cool. And then I did this weird looking uh, root system here. I uh, needed support, of course, for the radiator, and I split this with a four inch grinder and just kind of let that go wild like it's reaching for something. There's such personality behind this yeah. car, and, and up here, what's, what, what's your. What I wanted a hood here? scoop. I uh -huh. needed to get this thing just a little cooler, and I uh, thought of a sea anemone in the ocean. Yes. And then these guys are kind of eating, and that was my thought process because they give this away on the job site, and it's just all thread. Uh huh and uh, welded and then uh, weld some little nipples on there. This is all your work here? Oh, everything is, and we did everything. Okay. Uh, back here, we got scorpion over here. Uh, you know, no significant there, uh -huh. uh, just a spider and a scorpion, not really fighting, just kind of engaging. Just hanging out, it just looks good. Yeah, and some of the military guys really dig that. I don't know why, but uh, that's where the gas cap used to be. It looks kind of crappy, so I decided to do something there, and I just wound up with that. Okay, let's go around the back here. And what'd you do to the bed? Okay, so that is supposed to be 3D. It looks like a trunk, but it's supposed to just continue. This uh -huh. is the bed, that's the gas tank. 
It's this and that rat, two hands hanging onto it with some spiders. Again, all handcrafted by you. Everything's handmade, yeah, of course. And the tendons, they don't, they're not on the top, but that looks cool. And uh, this comes down, pull these out, drop them in there, and then this Old tailgate. Old school uh, from uh, stoves, yep, door handles? Yep, and then I can show you on the doors, I did door locks from the, because we have okay. the door handles, Let's right? See. By the way, too, this Open even, even just right here, Lance, like the, like the stitching, like the stitches you have. Yeah, we like to enhance uh -huh. some of this stuff. Instead of trying to bury it yes. and fix it, we just enhance it. So I went with the, with the, you know, the stitching the because stitch, it's yeah. kind of cool. Yeah, it's real cool. Kind of enhance it. We did the doorknob. This looks like, you know, your grandmother's bathroom doorknob. That's door exactly right. Is that what it is, grandma's bathroom That's door? right. And then we had to have the skeleton key, so it does have a deadbolt. Uh -huh. With the skeleton key, when you open that, that's the deadbolt here that comes in and locks the car. So... Are you building There's cars your building. entire life? No, this is the first one. Are you kidding me? No. This is, I mean, this is talent. The both this of you, is, the stuff you've done on your cars. Yeah, this is for the wife. So I had to muster up some, you know. Okay. Okay. And That's then cool. I have a hand there that holds the door open, kind of like hers on that side. Yeah. Okay, talk to me about the the, the dash here. What would you do with it? Okay, I just I didn't have a dash, so I had to make that. Okay. And then uh, the steering wheel is made out of horseshoes. Why not, right? Right, well, she's a, we love horses. And stitched everything up and around the windows and everything and the speakers, all that's all stitched. Metal floor mats, they'll never wear out. Right, yeah. Again, the stitching on the interior, the theme of the stitching. I yeah. love the theme of the stitching. It's got a heater in it. So this is... That comes out and that holds that door holds open. Holds the doors open, okay. So that the kids can't get in, but yet it, the two claws hang on to the car. And and, and uh, I've been to a, a couple shows and I've seen David at some shows and uh, I saw him at a show a couple weeks ago and I love it is, is you have these cars open and you're letting kids sit inside these things. Oh, that's you guys are not dream. afraid to share. No, let the them get in and have some fun. Yeah. Okay, can you start it up? Let's hear how it yeah. sounds. Okay. How, how fast does this go? Oh, it'll, it's, a, it's a quarter mile racer, so there's no telling how fast it'll go. I don't want to take it as fast as it'll go. All right, hold on one second. We, we ready? Let's try it. Okay. Oh, it sounds great. The neighbors like that? No. Probably oh, don't. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I tell you what, uh, we, we've taken enough of your time, but we can't leave here without going for a ride. Uh, there's four of us. So yeah, I let's think, get in the I caddy. Think go for a ride in the caddy? Yeah. Ride in the caddy, Lance? Perfect. Let's do it. <laughs> this is going to be special. AC is cranking inside this. I I just can't get over how that's big right it is. There. Yeah, we don't have much, but that's all. No, I feel it. What is that indicator in the front? Is that, that, that is a heat indicator, which actually came off of a wood stove. Yes. Well, part? Model A's got the little temperature gauge, right? So basically, that resembles the same years. Yeah. Of the little. And I love all the lighting you have inside this too. Yeah, she could probably hit a switch there, and this will come on in here. I'm not sure. Lights behind our heads here lit up. I don't know which one. I think it's the third one. There you go. Leave that just like that, honey. When you guys take this out for a ride, how many people are stopping? It, it's non-stop. Yeah. If we stop at a gas station or a store or something, we keep, we're just stuck with the car. It takes us an hour to go to the store and get a burger or something. Yeah, it's an hour to get gas. That's the compressors you hear back there. Okay. And you guys are the second owners. Yes. And as far as I know. The last time you know that this car was registered was when? Se what, what year? 70? 67. And what's the connection to the year 1967? That's my wife's birthday. That's okay. The year that I was so the year you were born was the last time this car was registered. Yes. Now you guys are working on this. You're pulling it apart and you find a, a 50 cent piece, a half dollar? The half dollar. It's on the dash there. Right there on the ben, dash. Lance. Ben Franklin 50 cent piece was stuck behind the dash. So it must have rolled in and out of the ash or the uh, glove box uh -huh. and was wedged back in there. And I was like, well, hell, I. I thought Chuck E. Cheese right away. Yeah, you know what uh, I mean? Yeah, old coins or something, yeah. Yeah, and then it winds up being a 50 cent piece. I now, was like, the year on that 50 cent piece? Is uh, 58. And the tie into 1958? 1958, the year I was born. Was yeah. the year you were born? That yeah. is nuts! That is, I mean, that is something right there. That is really something special. And the fact that you're the second owners yeah. of this it's, is, it's is an absolute trip. You can tell from the records, a lot of the records were wiped, but um, the the title was a 
original out of California and then the same owner um, registered in Nevada in Nye County up in Beatty and then as far as we know that's who parked it and sat until I scoped her out. You guys rescued her. You rescued yeah, her and did. back on the road. So it's a 19, 1936 yeah. Series 75. Yes. And that's the first year of the of the Series you 75. You have to ask her. She has it all in a library. I, I think, I, you know, I'm not 100% sure. I have, a, uh, I have a thing at home that I made. Um, I've tried to pull some information um, off of some of the websites. Yeah. For you know the older classic cars, um, but I do know this is a first generation um, touring sedan. And if you go back to to 1936, this was not cheap. Whoever no. bought this in 1936, they, they had, had some money, money yes. and they were living a really good life back in 1936. And you yes. had the depression and everything else in, the, in 1936. That was a tough time to move a vehicle. Yeah, the and they yeah. bought the literally top of the line vehicle. Yes. If the, if the walls of this Cadillac could talk, we tell some great stories. When I put that mirror on there and clean that mirror up yeah. and put it back on the car, I could feel, it's like, my God. You know, the last person that looked in this mirror So that's was the original the driver. mirror. That's the original mirror. Yes. How many yeah. people, you know when the person, they first bought this car in 1936, they're checking themselves out. They're looking in that mirror. Like, yeah, look at yeah. me. I got Driving down dirt roads and yes. we don't want to get it dirty, you know, because they didn't have pavement like And it was bought here today. in Nevada? Yeah, Nye, Nye County. Nye County? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, the original title um, was out of California. I mean, why don't you hit it a little bit, like all the way down there, just... <laughs> 6,000 pounds of car? Yeah! <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> this is great! Oh, that's it? Oh, that's this funny. This is so comfortable really back here, too. I mean, we're spread out. I want to go on a road trip with you guys. Let's yeah, go. there's like too much room here. Yeah, like let's crazy. go somewhere. Where do you want to go, Lance? Let's do it. Let's go to Mike. Let's go see Lance's family in yeah. Montana. I do feel like a king. <laughs> David, thank you so much. That thank was such you. a pleasure. It was really fun. Thank you, Teresa. Thank you so, so much. My gosh. Thank you. What a treat. And such so special fun. vehicles you guys built. That was fantastic. Thank you. If you want your car, shop, or collection featured on the show, then shoot us an email at cars, shops, and collections at gmail.com. That's cars, shops, and collections at gmail.com. And thanks for watching. And be sure and subscribe so you don't miss any future episodes of Cars, Shops, and Collections. Yeah. Yeah.